Hey everyone and welcome back to some more Endless Space 2. So, let's continue where we left off. And I'm going to suggest a truce with the Riftborn, as long as they give us the nearby system. If they accept, I'm okay with this. I mean, we can just declare war again in a bit. There's no problem with that. We have a lot of influence. So let's see if they are going to accept. Yes, they will. Nice. So now we got the system. Very nice. So maybe we'll get a chance to actually spread our vines without any interruptions now. That would be great. All right. So how about we move some of our ships? Which ones can we still move? We got one over here. We can keep him there as some basic defense, I suppose. And these guys, right. Let's attack the Lumeris. It would be nice to actually get rid of these fleets. There we go, we got rid of this one. That's helpful. But it's a little bit annoying how they just keep jumping in and out. And we have no real way to blockade them. Well, whatever. This turn's done. So, if we could colonize some of these, that would be great. We'll see about that. I still want Aquarius, by the way. That did not change. Also, we should probably explore this system down here. See what's going on there. We can send some scouts. Yeah, we can send these guys. Actually, no, we can't, because closed borders. Alright, that's fine. We'll probably just declare war again in a few turns. So, production. I think we have enough ships at this point, and upkeep is starting to be really expensive. So, I'm going to pass on that for a while. And build other things. Yep, sounds good to me. And one more production queue. House happiness, it's at 100%, alright. We don't really need that then. We don't really need manpower either, but I suppose we can get a little bit. So... Should we attack with this? Yeah, probably. Nine ships. Alright. Are they going to retreat? Yep, they will just keep retreating. Okay, whatever. Next. It's a little bit odd how they can retreat and yet still stay in the system. It's slightly annoying. How about Ying? How's our status in here? 27%. We need to lower it a little bit. Yep, just a little bit more. Hopefully we'll kill this. Come on. Alright, we got them. Nice. Fifty-two percent. We might be able to do it already. Possibly, yeah. I think it's worth a try. Also, can we do any upgrades to our ground troops? We should be able to. Let's have a look. Yeah, we certainly can. So, how about we do that? Twenty-five each. Okay. Oh yeah, we can't afford all of that. How much do we have? We got 29 antimatter. Alright, one upgrade. Better than nothing. We could also change the percentages if we want to. I see no need to change them really. I suppose we could get more air. Even in these grave times, the What's four going on? families have instructed me to propose... I'm not interested a in a truce, sorry. Alright, let's just start a ground invasion. 
Okay, and we'll try Gorilla. Does plus 40% health on invading troops. Alright, let's go with that. Minor victory. We might be able to win like this. Hopefully. If not, we can always send more troops. Because we have a lot of ships. And I assume most of them have full manpower. Yeah, these guys certainly do. I mean, we could just send them right away, but they can get there in like a turn or two. Anyway, oh yeah, we got some ship over here in the system. What do you think you're doing? What's that supposed to be even? Yeah, he retreated. I expected as much. So, what else? Let's see. Where's our stack of vine ships? Should be somewhere around here. Or maybe it's still on the way? Alright, let's find them really quick. There they are. Where are they exactly? Oh yeah, they are still on the way from the looks of it. Or what? Yeah, they are still on the way. So, next turn. Hopefully, Corona will be ours in a couple of turns. That is their home system, so that will hurt them a lot. A rival empire has placed a singularity. <laughs> yep, not much we can do about that. So, how's it going? Minor victory. Okay, we are winning. That's good. And we got a level up on our governor. I think he already has all the governor skills. I'm pretty sure he does. Yeah, the only thing we can... Well, we can get some morale bonuses, but we don't need those. Not really. We could just pick up some admiral bonuses in case we decide to use him as an admiral at some point. Yeah, I mean, might as well do that. What else are we going to do with him? There's not much that we can do with him. Alright, so, kill these dudes. Get out of here, that's my system. Alright, we got them. And there are still a few more? What's this supposed to be? Yep, still a few more. Alright then. I assume we can attack them with something, or can we? Not anymore, no. Can we spread in one turn now? Not yet. One turn. So, let's see if he's going to spread on the next turn, or will it get interrupted still? It's a little bit silly it gets interrupted when there's anything in orbit. But, oh well. Anyway, how's our income? Plus 800. I think we can get a few more ships. Which ones? We can get the big one. Alright, let's grab that one. Why not? And what else? Not a whole lot, really. We can send a few probes. Let's have a look. Do we have anything that can launch probes in the area? We can always just build a ship. Not really a problem. Also, some repairs. We can't afford them, can we? These repairs get really expensive. I'm almost thinking that it might be cheaper and more efficient to just let some of these ships get destroyed and then build new ones. It really feels that way, that it would be better. Well, anyway, let's continue. And I'll probably just declare war on the Riftborn again in a few turns. We could just do it right now, basically. Oh yeah, before we do that, let's go and get the manpower. Are we done yet? Yes, we are. Nice, we got it. Alright, so that's their home system. 
And how was the other one doing? Still 71%, really? Okay. Looks like we might need to send more. No problem, we'll send more. I'm pretty sure we crippled both the Luberis and the Reefborn at this point, though. Some things How much influence to declare war? To understand. Oh, it's free. What do you okay. Want? I think we should just do it then. How's the manpower? We need to spread vines to this system. So how about we go and do that? Okay, we spread vines to Veni. Because it was done in one turn. So I guess that's nice. Let's go spread vines to Estre. And then we can colonize the other systems nearby. Yep, sounds good to me. And kill this guy. Wait, we don't have a fleet around this system anymore? Yeah, we do. Come on. There. They destroyed one fire ship. That doesn't really matter. It's irrelevant. So, anything else happening? Yes, we know we have entwined Veni. Thanks for the update. Construction queue. Anything useful we can get here? Not really. We can get a little bit of extra manpower. So, that's a thing. And, oh yeah, Korana. Let's get some dust, shall we? Or, no, hold on. Let's get production first. How about planet specialization? Temperate cold, temperate hot. Alright. We should probably use production here. Like so. We could also terraform if we want to. But not here. Plus 20 production per planet. Alright, what else? Plus 4 per population on planets. I'm just checking which ones are more expensive. Okay, this seems reasonable. Alright, carry on then. We are going to control this entire part of the galaxy at this rate. <laughs> and hey, I don't mind. That's pretty much the plan. What's going on? Oh yeah, we finished building a trade clearing bureau. Nice. And we got another level up. Level 25 on the hero now. Alright, so any useful admiral skills? Yep. I suppose so. Anything else? Plus 40% shield absorption. Alright. Construction kills as usual. And we just finished research. What did we finish? Let's have a look. Oh yeah, production improvement. And dust improvement. Right. We can build those right away. Or can we? Oh, they require strategic resources. Okay, fair enough. We still need Curiosity Expedition power. Might want to research that sometime soon. Sounds like a good idea. And next one... Just get some extra manpower, that won't hurt. And let's see, let's unlock Curiosity Expedition. So, right here. Allows discovery of nodes and star systems unconnected to star lanes, using scanners, probes, etc. Oh yeah, that's also nice. But where's the Curiosity Expedition power? Do we need to unlock the next tier for that? Oh yeah, we do, don't we? Okay, well, we'll just work on this tier. What's this module? Fleet movement points. Oh yeah, that's quite nice, actually. Alright. 68%. We can probably assault sometime soon. We can probably just do it now. I think we have full manpower on all of these. 
Yes, we do. So we'll go with Gorilla. It's a draw. All right. Looks like we might need a little bit of help. Which won't be a problem, I don't think so. Get out of here, thanks. I wonder how many more systems they have. Can't be that many. Yeah, we might even be able to wipe them out completely, that would be nice. Well, I guess we'll find out. We can't go this way, can we? Nope. Alright then, so how about we declare war on the Riftborn? I'd like to spread vines first. Where's our fleet of vine ships? It's on the way, they need two more turns to get there. Alright, that's okay. Anything else? No, I think that's it. Do we have some more ships somewhere that we can grab? I suppose we could grab one of these fleets. And send help. Alright, sure. We can send some help. And we also got more over here, or do we? Yes, we do. Right, that's an entire fleet over there. Okay, but let's just send that one to assist with the system. Alright, the ground battle. Guerrilla still. We might be able to win this. Yeah, I think we'll win that without sending any reinforcements. Alright, sounds good to me. That's a pretty nice system, though. It has some luxuries that we do not have access to otherwise. Alright. So, our vine ship fleet is almost there. I just want to spread vines before we declare war. In case. It will keep getting interrupted again. Alright, production. Let's see, do we have any more curiosities that we can check out? Well, we do, but like I said, we need higher curiosity expedition power first. I think these are the only ones that we can scan. Yep, I think so. Well then, let's do something else. I suppose we could get some dust on some of these systems. Yeah, but let's get some dust. That definitely won't hurt. And one more. Nope, that's it. Are we there yet? Apparently I got some achievement. <laughs> Something to do with gold. Comrade. What do you want? I don't think I care, sorry. Minor victory. Yeah, I think we'll win without Even sending any reinforcements. Times, the four families have instructed they want a truce. I wonder a why. No, I'm not interested. At least not yet. Alright. So now we can spread our vines. Oh, hold on. We can actually... Check out a curiosity in here. Several, even. Alright. Maybe we'll find some resources? Yes, we will! Oh, that's not a deposit, though. We just got plus 20, and that's it. Alright. Hey, that's better than nothing. So, what else can we do here? We can generate more manpower. Alright. 
So the vine ships. Let's spread the vines and we'll just declare war on the next turn. One more idle system. We don't need morale, we are at 100% at this point. We can probably just build a few more ships. Especially the big ones. Sounds good to me, we are generating 2.5k dust per turn. More ships definitely won't hurt. Ground battle again, alright, let's hope we'll win this. It's a draw this time, but we still have an advantage from the looks of it. We got 510 left. Another singularity, alright, whatever. So, let's maybe merge these and attack. Oh, they actually brought a hero this time, alright. Let's see if he's going to help them. Probably not. Yep, decisive victory. Goodbye. It's been nice not knowing you. So, Astra is entwined. We might as well declare war then. Alright, let's do it. You're not one of them. You yourselves in life. No point waiting. Let's check the manpower first. Well, first, let's get rid of this guy in orbit. Oh, actually, he has quite a lot over here. Alright. That's fine. We still won. We destroyed everything. Alright, let's go and siege the systems, shall we? Where's the biggest fleet in here? We should probably merge some of these. Can we do that? I mean, we can merge the vine ships with the scouts. And we can also launch some probes in this general direction. Sure. Alright, hold on. I'm just trying to make this a little bit better. Split this. Okay, that's better. 22 out of 22. And do you guys have full manpower? You should. Yep, you do. Alright, let's go siege their home system. Off you go. And I assume we can entwine the next system now. Maybe send some escort. Like these guys. You will be okay, right? I think you will be okay. We can just build a few more ships in here. Why not? And we can send a few that we finished building. Let's have a look. Where's the carrier? I think we're still building one. Yeah, that's the one. Five turns. We got one in here, alright. Send it over to Estre. Let's build another one or two. Yeah, why not? More firepower is always a good thing. House production on this one? 653. We'll get a few fire ships. So, about that ground assault. Would be nice if we won. I think they have at least one more system. Seems that way. Just looking at their border. Did we win? It's a draw this time, alright. That's okay. We got some reinforcements now, so... If nothing else, we can always start another ground assault. If it's going to be necessary. Rip. Alright, what are you doing over here? Where are these guys coming from? I control every system that's connected to this one. Or blockade. This one is blockaded. This one is blockaded by us. I don't know where they are coming from. But okay. They just keep coming. 
Well, we destroyed more. I wonder how many ships we destroyed by now. Probably a lot. So, speaking of ships, let's get some extra experience on new ships first. And then we'll just build a few. And we finished our research. So... Oh yeah, allows discovery of nodes and star systems unconnected to star lanes using scanners, probes, etc. Alright. We do have this system over here. So, do we do it now? Can we just go there without it being connected? With vine ships? To entwine it? No, we can't just go there like this. Let's grab one exploration ship real quick. Alright, any more production? Nope, we are fine. Oh yeah, we need to pick new research. So I'd like to unlock tier 5 in science and exploration. Let's maybe work on that. What can we grab here that's actually useful? Not food. I don't think we need food. We can get more research. That's never a bad thing, I suppose. Yeah, sure. System improvement for more research. Can't go wrong with more science. So we'll send the probe towards this system right here. And see what we can do with that. Oh, nice. We got another new hero. Let's have a look. Focuses on fleet warfare and industrial production. Okay. I think we'll grab that one. I mean, these are all guardians, so they are basically the same. But we already have a militarist. I don't think we have a religious faction leader. So grab that guy. And we'll grab the skills right away. So. Experience on fleet. Hull plating penetration. Nice. Extra vision on fleet. Extra fleet health. Alright. Uh, hold on. Maybe not these points. Let's reset real quick. Extra hull plating. Extra experience. Fleet health. Okay. Plus 40% shield capacity. That's also nice. And that's that. And now we just need to assign him. We'll just grab any one of these fleets. One that's actually full, preferably. 18,000 to repair. Holy crap. That's a lot of money. Yeah, I'm almost starting to think that it's easier to let them get destroyed and rebuild them. Because with our production, we can rebuild them very quickly. So, I don't know. Just seems like a better way to go. Anyway, let's check the curiosity. Oh, nice. Quadrinix resource deposit. We definitely need that. So we should colonize this ASAP. A draw again, alright. Drive these guys out of here. Come on, get out of here. They retreated, alright. Fine by me. Where's our vine ship fleet? It's already here, isn't it? Yep. Oh yeah, we can't entwine this one. How is it not connected? Wait, we didn't actually entwine Estre? I thought we did. Well, I guess I was mistaken. Never mind. Let's have a look. More ships. How long to build the carrier? Six turns. That's reasonable. Merge these. Okay, looks good. However, I'm going to make a cut here and continue in the next episode. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.